Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to be talking a bit about my first client, okay? So if you stuck around for long enough or you've watched a few of my videos, I don't know, I don't know, right? You'll know that I signed a client a little over three or four months ago now. I think it's just over three months. Uh, yeah, it is. Three months ago, December 24th, I think it was, something like that. It was just before Christmas, because I remember, or just before New Year, something like that, right? But anyways, you'll know that I signed my first client, obviously a while back, but I haven't really given any update on it, if it's going well, if it's going bad, if it's like, you know, if I've created something absolutely amazing, or if I've failed, right? So in this video, I'm just going to give you like a little information on how that is actually going compared to my second client, or just how it's going in general. So for my client, I agree, like, so we agreed to create a community based around what he teaches. So what he teaches is like martial arts, so like fighting, whatever, right, boxing, blah, blah, blah. So he teaches stuff like that, and we agreed to create a community on Discord or through school, what people can join and pay for, and they can unlock his exclusive content. They can see how he does his techniques and whatever else he does, like, you know, on a day-to-day -day basis, how they can improve their self and their game, because he was some top, like, he was a world-class teacher, like, He's an, he's an amazing coach and he's won all these awards and stuff like that so he's got quite a good resume of what can be shown to people to like get them into the group okay so we agreed to do something like that along the lines of that right so what i included for him was to create a discord community tell him what they're putting and all that stuff i'll run it and all that make sure it all goes smoothly and just stuff along the lines of that okay and it all went well to be fair so within like the first week or something I created the Discord community. So actually I'm gonna get on to this first. My like so the start of the start of what I charged him was two hundred dollars, right? So no two fifty dollars, sorry, so about two hundred British pounds. So that was the start of the thing and I agreed to do all this stuff, create a web I mean, not create a website, create a community and handle it and all that stuff for him, tell him what the post whatever, right? And after the first seven days I actually got this community up and running for him. I got it all set up, I made sure it had a members area, it had all the free stuff. It just had everything what you need in a community just to make it grow, you know, make it more more wrapped and more fluent right so all this was done then we obviously got started up set some rules and stuff i told them what to do so also you're going to promote this discord through this way with this technique right i told them to do all this stuff and obviously people start joining i think we got up to like 150 to 203 members right it was something like that and it's obviously still up and running right now and of course we've got a bunch of paid members as well i can't remember how many paid members off the top of my head but i know for a fine fact he made his money back without giving too much detail right i know for a fine fact that he's still got recurring members and he's made some he's made money back from what he obviously has paid me like you know start the pre plus recurring whatever right he's made all that money back simply just from posting you know his technique his videos in this channel right we're yet to do any advertising or anything like that you know because we just haven't got round to it he's like you know he doesn't have enough time to do videos and stuff for advertising creative vid video or whatever right and we just haven't really discussed it much but that is definitely the next step we need to do advertising so we can get obviously the discord server the community up and running more people more members and all that stuff right however there has been a few flaws what i would like to improve on for my next client which i'm working with right now so the first flaw is it's not it wasn't converting as well as we thought of as well as i thought personally right and that truly was because like we just weren't communicating enough so i'm not going to put, fully blame it on him but i'm not going to fully blame it on me either right it was kind of like a 50 50 on why it, it's not field but like you know it hasn't done as well as it should have so the first reason is we should have like you know create a better convert and way of getting people into the discord and people to pay for the discord right stuff like that can be easily done which of course i've improved on my strategies i know what to do for my next client now which of course it's going to help improve stuff like that so that was the first thing what i really could have improved and i, I might make a video on it, you know just to help use out a little bit you know just make sure you can do that but the first thing is literally convert it's just such an easy thing to do all you've got to do is create a video about it you know a video of what like explain how you can help people fix what they want whatever how you can improve their game their technique in martial arts right something like that had to be done but it wasn't done instead he just put up a little post like an instagram post announcing like you know our new community and all that stuff come join blah blah, blah. but he didn't really explain what it was going to be about of course it should have been my it's my fault as well for not telling him to do that like you know not giving him more information and stuff like from someone who's actually like he's paid me to do that but you know like he should have created like a proper video explaining whatever like just a seals page a seals video right just something like that something like that should have been told but you know it just wasn't done so that was the first flaw or the first fault which you know i've improved on for my next client right and the second one was kind of just like 
more content in the members area, you know, for the clients, more free content, you know, just to convert people. Once again, it's all about converting. So the content needs to be more quality. It's got to go more in detail to explain to people. It's got to be worth paying for, right? So a lot of the members who did pay did unsubscribe after a month or two simply because the content maybe it wasn't worth it. Some might think it was, but they didn't want to pay it, and some thought it was worth it. I mean, it wasn't worth it, sorry. But the content simply wasn't work, uh, worth it, so we just weren't keeping members to won't recur members getting a solid income each month which of course you've got to improve on because you know it's a community how else are you going to pay for what if you want to pay for if it's not coming through so the content would need to be up to have to be higher quality it'd have to be more interacting with the audience you know telling them what's what how you can do this better you explain what you're doing just stuff like this it can easily be improved of course it comes if you're a good teacher or a bad teacher if you're good on video or if you're not it of course comes down to a lot of things but if you're working for something like that, like that it, you've got to get all these skills you've got to acquire them you've got to become a good teacher you've got to explain your points you've got to think out loud so see i don't know i'm going to give a martial arts so see you were showing how to execute a jab properly you're going to show all of the the things what you're doing or your footwork or you you're twisting your hips whatever right all this stuff's got to be explained in detail to make it actually worth it so people can see an improvement get results then you can use them results to get more people and they will stay in that community because they've got results they've seen it they'll be like oh wow this has changed my life this has been brilliant so far i'm going to stick in because i'm sure i can learn a lot more from you instead they weren't really getting that because you know the content what was put in they could have got that for free elsewhere of course it won't have been by the same person but you know they could have got something more similar about it than you know than paying for it like 10 to 15 dollars i forgot what it was i think it was 18 dollars but paying 18 dollars a month for content what they could have got free somewhere else like and it possibly could have even been better you never know just you know you've got to explore for stuff like that but that's definitely one flaw that i've got to you know increase on like it's just something i've got to uh, make sure it's all alright for my next client which of course i have done i've give them i've written out a whole google doc for my next client you know just because i feel like it'll go a lot better in cases if like you know their content isn't good and of course i will remind them oh okay so you've got to up the content make sure you're explaining these points this point that point right i'll make sure to do that you know simply just improving constantly because that's what you need to do in business you've constantly got to up your game and improve just so you know you're actually ahead of the competition and you're providing for your clients you're getting them results so that's kind of like just, you know, the two main points of like how my first client went or is going so far because I'm still working with them, obviously. So, you know, that's just kind of how it went to begin with. Of course, I will improve on them aspects. You know, I will make sure it's better for my next client and my future clients because obviously the better results for them is it's going to work out better for me and them. It's just like it's a massive loop, right? You provide results for them, you get a new client and it works out, you get more money. So it's just stuff like that, right? You want to constantly be improving, even if like, even just because it's someone else, right? It's your client. If they, if you're not providing good results, they'll go to someone else and pay them money instead, right? They'll not work with you because why would the client want to work with you if you're constantly not trying to improve and get better results for them? You know, just like it works out so much better for you if you're constantly trying to improve every minute of your DI, every minute of your business. Day, you're constantly trying to improve, learn new strategies, get better results, and all that stuff. It just works out a lot better for you and the client. It's just a recycle, you know. But anyways, I will try up you and help you out as well because you know that's the whole point of these videos right is just simply to record my data and record my knowledge and share it to all of you you know just so you can get clients and do better with your clients and your business so that's all i'm going to see for this video here but that's all see you all later